Hey guys, what's up? It's 77 welcome back to Osiris New Dawn. So, as was common with all almost all uh, early access games, there was a patch that came out that required a full-on restart, so I had to... I'll, I basically picked up where I left off. Um, habitat built, inflatable dome, forge, a couple of depositories, and picking up in a new, wholly new spot. Um, kind of looking forward to it because they added a lot of additional stuff. Um, they made, uh, you can get resources back from deconstructing things, which is pretty cool. So if I had my multi-tool out, for example, I can totally do that. I can just, uh, get back some parts for that I made to make the wall here. Um, as well as, uh, some little minor bug fixes and clean up and that kind of thing. So, a lot of fun. Anyway, so, uh, we'll go ahead and pick up where we left off. Um, uh, looks like right now I need to go ahead and make an airlock. Uh, and I should have enough materials to make an airlock at least. What does the airlock require? It requires 10 steel, 2 glass, 20 aluminum, 5 copper. Now I believe... Did I put that in here? I got steel and I got glass. And an extra dome would be kind of nice. But I think I put aluminum and copper in here. Here we go. Aluminum and copper. Okay. So let's go ahead and make our airlock. And once we get the airlock done, then this habitat will be fully functional. I believe. There we go. Uh, confirm build. Activate it. And... Boop! Done. Let's head inside. You gotta pressurize the inside. And now... I'm inside, and it's like, not all, it all lights up for me, and everything's like, cool. Sweet. Okay. Now, need to make a chemistry table, which is found in here? No. Here we go. Uh, five steel, ten glass. So let me go ahead and head back out. Step back outside, hop on over to the, our depository here. And grab us some glass. But I need more steel. Um, let's make that. I should have plenty of magnesium. And iron. So I even though even with the um, the reset of the game, I am quite enjoying this. It's just, it's quite a quite a fun game. Um, I have in this new location I have yet to encounter where the worm is, where the sandworm. Uh, Shah Hulud, whatever the thing is called, uh, according to the Dune um, mythos. But uh, I'm looking forward to it. Oh, activate. Because then I can mark out where he is. And what I want to do is I want to... Uh, resources I've found around here are much more sparse. So I need to find... Let me get some uh, other things taken care of first. So, here we go. Uh, chemistry station I'm going to build... Uh, right there's fine. That'll be good. Right next to the door. And then I think I can also put a... What is it? Um, I could put a set of things here, too. Like, I could put a locker, I believe. We got a storage locker right there. If I had some rubber, uh, some storage crates I could put. Um, I could put a kitchen, but I need lithium and wire for that. Uh, shower requires a barracks. Water reclaimer. I can use this water reclaimer here. It would be kind of nice. I just need um, circuit board, rubber, and wire for that. Oxygenator uh, in a habitat. I got titanium. Need circuit board and wire for that. And the fabricator, I think, is next. And in fact, that's the next thing on the list to do. But let's take a look at what we could do in here. So, chemistry, I can make rubber if I have carbon, hydrogen gas, and chlorine gas. And I make plastic, which I'd need. But in order to make a fabricate, I need two plastics, so I need to have 150 hydrogen and two carbon. I can make soil if I have sand and poop. I can make a uh, container of water if I have oxygen and hydrogen. Makes sense. Hydrazine, hydrochloric acid, fluorescence. Hmm. PCX. I wonder what that is all about. Fencyclidine. Interesting. Hmm. Nothing in currently. So, 
Oh, oh, I can't get bent? Oh, I need rubber too. Uh, so I think I need to do is I need to go out into the world and hunt down some rubber. But I'm going to go ahead and take along Buddy Bot with me. Because I need him to uh, start mining other things I've found. Like, I need to get some more iron, I think. Um, yeah, iron and aluminum. So, Buddy Bot. Hey. 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 Uh, follow me. No, no I pulled up no, some videos for you. No, 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 no. God dang it. I need to deactivate Cortana. Follow. Thank you. Sorry. Cortana came up. I don't like it. I don't care about listening to videos. Dang. You know, it's kind of funny. I I, <laughs> I kind of enjoy the whole Cortana and the, 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 the Google, you know, say, okay, Google, and then it responds and that kind of stuff. I do enjoy having that kind of ease of use because that's really, really interesting and high tech and everything. It just it sucks when it gets in the way. I gotta make like a safe word or something. Like I can't just say, you know, you know, summon Cortana with those words. I should use something else like, I don't know, pineapples. That'll be a good safe word, right? Pineapples is a good safe word. Um, one of these trees are over here. I think these are what I need. I think the rubber trees. Yeah, they are. So I think what I can do is I can go up to them and I can break them. Oh, yeah. I can break them forever. Just like this. Just, just whack them and whack them and whack them and whack them. And get rubber. And I can actually pick up additional rubber on the floor here. And there's some here. That's handy. And I can even go over here. Wow, it's like it just naturally spawns. Hmm. Nice. Now, where's Buddy Bot? Buddy Bot. Oh. Silly robot, you're over there. Ooh, magnesium. And a skeleopod. Eh. 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 Come on, what you got? Nothing. Can't climb up here. My house. Ha! Eat it. Buddy bot? Come on, dude. There's copper over here. You can get copper. Come on. You better not be broken. Jeez. Stupid robot. Oh, well. I wonder if there's iron. I need to find iron. Source of iron. I'll just link, jump along through here. Um... So I don't know if you guys have been paying attention to the news. I know there's a lot of, you know, political stuff going on right now, but at least... NASA has been announced that has announced that it is planning on more uh, on expanding its its reach when it comes to the ooh is that plutonium is that uh, is that my, oh, it's magnesium okay um, it's planning on starting the whole uh, yeah, I think it actually is starting the next steps our proving ground phase uh, for going to Mars and I'm looking really forward to that um, even though right now it'll consist primarily of just um, you know, testing stuff in space, like the space station and all that stuff. Uh, it'll be kind of fun. Plus, it'll be really interesting to, to read all about that and hear all about what's going on up in space and how the astronauts are handling it and all that kind of thing. It'll be kind of cool. And, and I tell you, I hope to death that eventually I too can go to space because that would just, that's one of my biggest, biggest dreams. Just to go to space, that'd be kind of really, really cool. So, yeah. So I, I would love nothing more than to head up to space to, uh, to meet, meet my future out in the cosmos, and help you know with the whole betterment of humanity and all that jazz. It'd be really cool. It's all wait, wait list. Plus, it's a whole new frontier, and no one's actually seen a whole lot in deeper space. And plus, if we, if uh, if we believe what Elon Musk is planning on doing, then soon we'll have a commercial flight. Sometime soon. I know he's promising like the 
uh, 2018 to 2020s. But um, hopefully, hopefully sooner. Fingers crossed. All right, I am delving quite a bit far away. And let me see, there's Buddy Bot. He's having plenty of time climbing up this ridge. I wonder where some quality iron can be. I notice you're somewhere. It's out here. Maybe. But I also know that when I was out gathering materials to get back to where we were, I did happen to spy some lithium. They're usually like right up against the rocks. Just kind of like clinging to the underside of one. Just little nodules of lithium. I'm just wondering, where did I see those? They're in here somewhere. How much rubber do I got? I got 24 rubber. Or 22. And aluminum. That's good. I can make use of that. Uh, actually, I wonder if I should go ahead and just... Yeah, I'll go ahead and have Buddy Bot mine the aluminum. It's another thing he can he can go take care of. Now, it's a ways away, but if I have him constantly going for it, then that'll be a steady supply. And that'll be good. I can do that. All right, Buddy Bot. Come here. You are going to patrol in mine, and I'm going to send you right over there. Good. In the meantime, I'm going to go this direction. Or was it over there? Dang, I lost it. Good thing I could hop around. I what that was. It's kind of disconcerting seeing giant plumes of dust go flying. Oh, it's that thing. It's like a giant dung beetle. You know, what I, I have noticed while playing this is there's a habit of the creatures to, like, their feet don't necessarily move to land on the ground. It's like they suddenly target the ground and they go for it. So I wonder... It's a colossus. Oh, well, that was fast. I guess there's a little bit of, of gaming there. Is if, uh, if you go far enough away after sending BuddyBot to go mine stuff, he will uh, pretty much instantaneously bring it back to the depository. Yeah, look at that. Just way fast. Okay. There's a Skellipod. I want to kill it. I want to deal with it. Come on. Come on. What you got? What you got? Nothing. And there's that. Ah, there's iron. I do need that. I'm going to go get that. Looks like there's plutonium on the other far side over there, too. I wonder if this is where I found the lithium. Well, I'll have to just go ahead and dig it up now. Iron. Perfect. Okay. Come here. Black the iron a little bit. So let's grab all that. Come here. Come here. Come here. You chunks of iron. Good. Make sure nothing's trying to kill me. And back at it. Alright. Uh, I have I now have 55 iron. I could probably get a little bit more. Just mine all that. Now, what I also need to make sure to look out for is I need to look out for plumes of gas. I found some blue ones not too far from here, um, but that's oxygen, and I don't quite need that yet. What I do need are the yellow gas, which is, is it plutonium. Yeah, it's plutonium. Um, the yellow gas, which is going to be our uh, hydrogen supply. And where there's hydrogen, there's also carbons because apparently, oh god. Uh, no, you don't want to eat me. No. Oh god, what is this thing? It looks so freaky. Oh, I almost landed in the in the spines. Eh. Ha! Wow, this is a resource-rich area. Look at this. Look, there's irons, aluminum. There's a couple of tumbos, which are look like giant turtles. Yeah, turtles. There's lead. Copper, 
Oh my god, this is the resource mother load. And there's trees everywhere. Hmm. We may have found paradise. But it is getting hard to see. I wonder what is out here. I wish this fog would go away. Dang, I can't see anything. No, at least I'm heading back towards my spawn's point, which is good. <sighs> Eventually I'll find something. Yes, Luna, I hear you. Man, what I wouldn't get it to be able to go to space so I can take you with me? Oh my god, seeing Luna flounder in space would be hilarious! She'd be like, nah, nah, I can't move. I can't move, I can't get the pro Oh god, there's Jackulus. Um... Let's just go ahead and dive over here. The Horizon Va Volcano. Okay. Uh, which gives us carbon and hydrogen. Oh, here it is. It's only 400 away. Nice. So I'll have to come back for it later. Because it is raining and I need to, to, to jet. And there's more plutonium. Is it still chasing me? Yes. The parasites. What are they? Go on. Go, snaky thing. Die. Parasites, too. They're both gone. Those parasites usually come in groups of four. I don't like them. They're evil. Eh, run. Back home. It's getting dark. I don't like it. I don't trust it. Well, at least weather's not too bad. I mean, there's no, like, there's not a dust storm, which is good. It's just an annoying, um, rainstorm. I wish I could refill my water this way. Just be like, oh, just, like, lift up and go, ah. Oh, good, it's clearing. Sweet. Alright, heading back. And, uh,. With this, I believe I'll have plenty of materials now. Now let's take a look at our supply. We got some aluminum in here, which is good. We got more iron, which is even better. Um, now we have some magnesium. I can go mine a little bit more to make more steel, but what I want to get that done first is... Uh, shoot. I need plastic for the biodome. I need plastic for the barracks, and way too much stuff for that. So I can make a uh, I can make a hallway. If I had gold and wire, do I have gold? Did I pick up gold? I picked up some gold, but I still need the fabricator. So I need to get the fabric. Now I can also make barrels, these from steel and copper, and I can make those so I can carry gas and, and get that taken care of. So I think that's what I'm going to have to do for uh, for next time. Uh, as for right now, uh, I want to thank you for joining me for this episode of, um, of Osiris New Dawn. If you are new to my channel, hit the subscribe button. If you like, leave a comment, let's do that kind of thing. If you're enjoying the series, let me know. Um, and uh, I hope you guys join for next time. So in the meantime, see you guys later, and have a good day. Bye-bye.